Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, mmm. Good timing, too. Some customers are already lining up. We have some old resources to pawn off on them to get you started. Oh, tap on this customer's order to see what they want. Drag the items into the crate to complete the sale and profit. <laughs> Doing all right, I see. But now we need to get mining and find some more stuff to sell. Double tap to zoom in and out of an area. Whee! Oh, seems we're in luck. These lazy giblins already dug up some rusty bits in between naps. Swipe your finger on the resources to collect them all. Now for the fun part. Tell these little loyal fools what you want next and they'll dig it up for you. No need to get your hands dirty. Ooh. Tap anywhere on the mine to view its available resources. And that's it for now. Come back to collect materials when they are ready. Make sure your mines are always producing something. Oh my. Mmm. If you want to grow your business, then you better get digging. So let's repair the foreman room. Look at these lazy little critters down in their break room. Ooh. Mmm. Tap and hold a giblin to pick them up. Drag and drop them onto the construction area to start building. Look at him go. Should be ready any second now. Ah. Now that we have an active foreman, we can start excavating dirt to clear the way for more underground rooms. Oh my. Tap some dirt to get going. Now drag the tool over the spaces you want to excavate. Then tap the check mark to begin. Excavation is fun, but more importantly, profitable. You'll find lots of goodies underground. Be sure to keep your farm in digging at all hmm. times. Wow. 
I present you our glorious quest board. It's been handed down from generation to generation to great giblins and, well, I guess you get to use oh, it. Oh, my. Mmm. Oh, a green arrow. Oh, so shiny. That's it. Tap the quest board again to check it out. Ah, from here you can see all your challenges and achievements. This should keep you organized for a while. Progress on those oh, goals hmm. and tap on the green arrows to claim those awesome prizes when you're done. Be sure to check back every day. All right, enough idling now. Back to work. You can now expand your lair and build all sorts of new rooms both above and below ground. Let's see what's available now. Oh my. Tap the hammer in the bottom left corner. A hatchery is what we need. Drag it to that big empty spot right over there. All that's left is to assign a giblin to start construction. There should be some left in the break room. Anyone will do. Ah, hmm. to the hatchery. Here in this charming cavern, you can incubate any of the eggs you found. Ooh. Drag an egg from the top of the screen onto the workstation below. Well done. It's gonna take a little while for that one to hatch, but you can always speed up the process with gems. Yeah, take a few. This one's on me. Go ahead. Don't be shy. Use your free gems to hatch this egg. Give it a name and put it to work. You'll find it being lazy in the break room.
Woo! <laughs> 